Carrie and Petrucci from Geeks Life. Today I have an exclusive video for you right here on Digital Trends. Let's talk about DIY kits for kids. Ever since my nephew was four years old, I've been buying him DIY kits, robot kits, science kits, all that fun stuff. I wish I had this stuff when I was young, so we like to geek out together and work on this stuff. I recently discovered Tinker Crate. It's a subscription service where you pay $20 a month and you get a new toy every month to put together. It's just like Loot Crate for us adults. These are fantastic ways to get your kid's brain working in a way that might encourage them to tinker with STEM-like projects, science, technology, engineering, and math. The more exposure they have to the ideas that they can create something, the more chances are that they'll build stuff on their own later in life, right? So there are crates for ages three to four, then five to eight, then nine to 16. In the older range, they have both the doodle crate for building creative confidence, as they say, and then the tinker crate is for STEM projects. The crate comes with all the parts needed. Now, sometimes you might need something like scissors that they don't include, but you won't have to go out and buy anything. I mean, you should already have scissors. You do have scissors, right? Anyway, it also includes directions, they call it a blueprint, a magazine full of cool information, and all the parts. What I'm mostly impressed by was how well done the directions are. My nephew is very smart, not that I'm biased in any way at all, but there was never a moment of, wait, what am I supposed to do? I was also worried about getting him to sit down and focus on it, and I've heard that same fear from other people who've thought about getting these crates, but that wasn't a problem at all. I thought it might take two or three hours to get through the project, but he worked through it in about 30 minutes. Now, this one was the draw bot that we worked on, and they all vary on amounts of time or level of involvement needed. Some of the others are drip irrigation, the biomechanical hand, a hand crank flashlight, the gravity game, and even, this is awesome, a motion sensing spider that can detect when people are close and it pounces on them. <laughs> These aren't made of the type of material that's gonna last for years. It's 20 bucks per package after all, but it is a great way to keep their mind engaged on a regular basis and give your kids something to look forward to each month and they actually can look forward to getting it because the package is sent to their name, not your name. It has their name on the box, which I think is an awesome touch. What kinds of things do your kids like to create? I would love to hear about them. Leave a comment below and use the links above to share this video on your favorite social media sites. I'm Laria Petrucci. You can find more of me at geekslife.com or of course, right here on Digital Trends. Bye-bye.